joining us in the studio is Tom Dannett, the CEO and founder of Street Child, a charity set up 14 years ago with the aim of making sure all children are safe and receiving an education, especially in poor countries and war zones. Tom, thank you so much for coming in to talk to us today. Okay. First of all, give us uh, your view on what is actually happening in Ukraine right now. Yeah, look, I think we can all see it on our TV screens. Um, it's a tragedy. I, I can't think of any equivalent in, in my life where a million people have left their, their country and, may, and it's women and it's, and it's children in, this, in less than a week and the, that is number is going to rise, it's going to be deep into the millions in, in a week or two at a time um, and it, it's no surprise that the great British public um, are, are, are responding um, to, to the needs of the people they can see on their screens. It's great that the the DEC has, has got involved launching its appeal this evening and Street Child is not part of the DEC. Um, we're um, running our own separate appeal, working in, in our own characteristic way. Your charity, Street Child, has got great experience around other parts of the world, not necessarily this part of the world, but you do have contacts and that's where that's key to helping people on the ground. That's exactly it. So Street Child's core methodology is to, uh, is to identify a situation you want to move in, such as the Ukraine crisis right now, uh, and then to identify local organisations um, in the towns, cities, villages, um, uh, who, who the sorts of organisations who wouldn't necessarily be picked up by, by big charities or, or UN agencies. Um, and we identify those through our networks, we perform basic due diligence, and then we funnel support to them as, as quickly as possible. So we've already, although we only launched our appeal on, on, on Friday, um, and only made initial contact with organisations at the start of the week, we've already started making our first transfers into Ukraine um, in, in the last couple of days. And these are two organisations which are, are grassroots, and, um, and they're on the ground, they know the problems that are being faced and they will respond flexibly to the situation the best way they can. Key, it? Yeah. it is so wonderful to know that there are so many charities trying to help at the moment. A lot of people feel like they want to do something and I think from what, from what you're saying, cash is king really. But we also need to remember that even though the focus is heavily on Ukraine at the moment, there are families, children suffering around the world. Yeah, that's a, such an important point. If I'd known two weeks ago that I was going to come on this program and talk about street child's work, I'd have been certain we'd been talking about the millions of children on the brink of starvation in, in Afghanistan, uh, where street child's got 100,000 children that we're working with, um, over 1,000 staff on the ground. And that's just one of the 20 countries we're working in. Uh, and there are others around other countries where there are crises as, as well. And it's absolutely right that we have a massive focus on Ukraine. But we should also remember that just because there are tanks rolling around um, Ukraine, that those children in Afghanistan need the same support they did two weeks ago as well. And that cash really will go to help those people re really on the front line trying to get to safety and get out of the country. Yeah. And, and Street Child's commitment is 100% of, of, the, of the funds we receive into our U Ukraine appeal. We are going to send straight through to our Ukrainian partners, so it's the efficiency there is total. And then those Ukrainian partners, they, we think they will make the best decisions about how to allocate that money. So it, it's, it's a great way to, to provide fast, effective support. Absolutely, that's great. Well, Tom Dannett, thank you so much for what you're doing at your charity. Thanks for coming on the programme this evening. Thank, Talk you. To us. thank you so much for having me.